Little girls in our bodies, always under attack. Yeah, that rage I felt back then is still here sometimes. You know, like, when a man looks at you like you're a piece of meat. Oh, girl, that's the worst. And you just know that he's only seeing you as a sexual object. I just don't understand that. That's so infuriating. That and cat calls. Same thing, but that was the first time someone called me a hoe. No! Tell me nobody calls you that again. Oh, it happened again, all right. When I was about 18 or 19, a neighborhood fool made the mistake and called me out my name. What? Why? He was angry because I ignored his cat calls, said that I was a snooty you-know-what, and tried to embarrass me in front of a group of friends. Really? I was ready then. Tell me you didn't fight him. My assault was verbal this time. Did you cuss him out? No. When he called me out of my name, I turned around real slow, looked him dead in the eye, and I said very slowly and deliberately, you should know your mama trained you. Oh, words. Yeah. If he thought I would cower when he called me out of my name, he challenged the wrong woman. Yes, queen. Girl, you a queen from way back. Better believe it. I'm so happy so about that. that. Then I turned and walked away like I didn't care. And like I didn't give a care about nothing. Ooh, he must have felt like a fool. Sure did. I heard his friends sniggering, and some of them were egging him on to counterattack. What'd he do? What'd he do? Nothing. <laughs> they were so embarrassed, he couldn't say a word to me. As a matter of fact, that was the last time he had ever said anything to me. You know that's right. Trust and believe, even his buddies didn't say a word to me after that day. They were afraid to look in my direction. <coughs> I know they were. Shoot, I didn't have the patience for nobody's foolishness. Ain't it funny how some people are always quick to call a woman out of her name? Because it's easy. I guess. It's almost like it's part of being a woman. Like it's part of our history. Even women are willing to call other women bitches and hoes. Fall yeah. into the negative narrative. Mm -hmm. It's sad how these things stick with you, though. Don't they? For a long time, I had to practice saying, self, you ain't no hoe. And on really bad days, I repeated the affirmation over and over again. But sometimes, somehow, I don't always believe it. That's that blaming game. I guess it is. But I'll tell you one thing. That was the last time anybody called me out my neck.